hello friends in this video we are going to find the customers who has placed more than one order in the last month okay let's suppose we have two tables customers and orders so the customers table contain the information about customer that is customer id and customer name while the orders table contain order details such as order id customer id order date and order total so we need to fetch the records customers who has placed more than one order in the last month so we are going to achieve this query in five steps okay so first we will bring the data from orders table and then we will add one where condition that gives us the records in the last month and then we will do the group by which gives us the count of orders so in the later stage we will write the where condition that gives the uh, count is greater than 1 or 10 whatever may be and at the end we will join the customers table to get the customer name okay so before that uh, before proceed writing the query i would like to explain about one function that is date underscore sub so so in uh, mysql select current date so this function will give us the current date so if you want to go back to the previous previous day of the current month that is date underscore sub so I'm going to provide current date as the date here current underscore date comma interval one month okay let's see the output of this query so current date should give us the current date so that is 230625 and this date sub is going to return the exact day of the previous month we need the records which is greater than this date so that will give us the last month information for that um, we will add the condition like select star from orders so if you see the data here we have total eight orders and four customers so we need to fetch only the records that are greater than 525 so current date is 625 we need last month so that is coming from 525 to till date okay so for that we will add this condition this condition to the where class so okay from customers where order date greater than greater than or equal to okay, let me run this query okay so these are the only customers who has placed orders after or uh, on or after 525 okay now that we have the customer list we need to find the count of orders by each customer okay for that customer underscore id comma count of order id so this one will use as the number of orders each customer has placed so from orders where and then group by group by customers customer id so here we are grouping this data by the customer id which means so when a record is repeated so this 3 and 3 will be grouped and this one will give us the count of order id so here how many records have duplicate uh, multiple orders from each customer so 3 and 1 okay so when we count the number of orders for customer 3 it should give us it will give us 2 same for the customer id 1 it will give the output 2 so let me execute this query now okay so we got the correct output as a next step what we are going to do so we have done the grouping next step we are going to filter the result set so, so 
so we can do this in a different ways for now i am going to use this query as a sub query select star from okay so i am going to name this sub query as s1 okay where yes one dot so let's give some alias for this count of order id as count underscore orders okay so where s1 dot count orders is greater than one so if it's greater than one it should which means it should have more than one order okay let me execute this query okay so customer id 3 and 1 has placed more than one order in the last month okay now we need to get the customer name so till now we are using the only orders table the orders table there is no customer name so customer name can bring it from the customers table so for that we need to join the customers table okay select c dot customer name i'm going to alias customer table as a c so i'm going to use c dot customer name comma so so we need to give one alias to the another sub query let's say this is another sub query s2 okay from s2 what we need s2 dot count underscore orders from customers c join okay join this table s2 yes so on c dot customer id is equal to s2 yes dot customer id okay let me execute this query that's it we have the customer name and the count of orders instead of using where condition to filter the records who has count of orders more than one we can also use having function having class after group by okay let me modify this query by using having function let me copy this query till here group by okay now we want the count greater than one so having count of order id greater than one so by using ha having we are avoiding one sub query here okay so this one will give us the same data result three one okay so at the end what we need to do we need to join this table let's say this one is one table so the table is t1 we are going to join select customer name from customers c okay c dot join t1 on t1 dot customer id is equal to c dot customer id so this one will also give us the same result you can use having after group by i hope this tutorial is helpful to you if you like this video please hit the like button and do subscribe to my channel thank you for watching